I love the premise of this show so much. Having been a musical theater person myself, one of my favorite shows was Annie to be in, and I was so happy that you guys did Annie first. And I want to ask you, is there a show that, as a musical theater performer, you would want to go back to and recreate all over again with your original high school cast? I mean, to be honest, I would do any of them. <laughs> I would do absolutely any of them. We did, um, in high school, we did Little Abner, we did Wizard of Oz. Um, I've also done a fair amount of like regional theater. I did a little night music a few times that I would love to go back. I would like to switch roles a couple times though. I'd really like to play some adult roles because I've always been so short, I've always played the kid. Um, but yeah, there, I do this professionally and I still have the draw to get back on stage with people I know that I've created something with just to have fun. And that was the whole goal. But the premise here is we're taking there's no part of this where you have to be a real performer. This is just get back on stage for the sake of having fun. And there is something so electric about watching people do something just because they want to. Because nothing in life is that, right? You do things because you have to. You have to go to your job. Sometimes, sure, you take a nap or you go to a movie because you want to. But a real experience, just because you want to time travel, sort of go back and see a group of people that you know and reintroduce yourself. There's something really, really beautiful and this show is nothing but positive. And it is, we have casts that are millennials, so they've seen each other recently. We have casts that are baby boomers that haven't seen each other in 45 years. And it is incredible to watch them goof around, make amends, um, and, and just sort of having shed the labels they had in high school and, and get to know each other now. And it's really emotional, even as an audience member, just watching them yeah. go through this process and coming out of it so exuberant. Yeah, there, it's every single, I was a little bit worried, like, high school is a traumatic time, right? It's the one thing that unites us all. It's the one thing we all have in common. It is turbulent, right? And I was like, are we gonna traumatize anyone having to go back to high school? And every single cast, when we wrapped, said, gosh, I wish it wasn't over. I wish I could do it again. Um, it is a show about having the courage to be seen and be vulnerable and to forget but also to remember. And how do you choose these casts? There is a, a pretty intense casting process that we didn't think we would have enough casts. We were like, how are we going to get 10 people from the same musical in the same city and have it be all over the states? And Shockingly, the minute we started advertising for it, we were inundated with thousands of people who said, use my high school musical theater cast. I'd love to get back on stage. I really want to see what so-and-so is up to. I want to get back on stage and do my role. I would die to perform again. And a lot of these people, they have nine to five jobs that they are like, I would in an instant love to take seven days off and have this experience. So we actually had a hard time choosing, but we got some extraordinary extraordinary casts. Are there plans for a second season? I certainly hope so. I'll announce it now. I haven't been told yes, but I'll go ahead and announce it now. I'm an optimist. Okay, <laughs> thank you so much for talking to me. Sure.